Hey guys, Martin here from Mattress Clarity. If you spend much time on Instagram, you've probably heard of the Thuma bed frame. A lot of influencers are trying it out and posting about it. So I wanted to try it out for myself. I wanna take a look at its design, setting it up, who it's a good fit for and who it's not a good fit for. Is it as high quality and easy to set up as they say? Let's find out. Before we get started, I will note that we receive some products for free from brands. We may earn a commission if you decide to purchase them. This helps keep this content free for you and helps fund our testing operations. So now let's talk about the major details you need to know about the Thuma bed. First off, it comes with a 100 night sleep trial, a lifetime warranty, and free shipping and returns. But looking at the bed itself, first off, it's made from repurposed wood. It actually uses something called Japanese joinery. So without tools, you can set it up. It links together at the sides. I'll actually talk about this more during the setup section. It also has wooden legs and cork on the bottom to keep it from scratching your floor. In terms of the slats, it's gonna have recycled wood there that rolls out very easily. You have eco felt to make it kind of nice and even, three inches between each slats. You can also choose between a headboard or a pillow board. The headboard is also made of recycled wood and the pillow board is made of foam with polyester fabric around it. You can also choose between different wood colors. We got the walnut color here today. So what makes this such a special bed frame? Well, first off, I am not the most stylish guy, but this is a very cool looking bed frame. It has a very sleek, modernist design. It's super low slung, doesn't take up a lot of space. And as we'll get to in a second, very easy to set up. But let's talk about setting up the Thuma bed. And if you ask anybody, I am the least handy guy in the world. Like Ikea builds give me a panic attack. I am really horrible at it. So when I saw three boxes come for this base, I kind of freaked out. How am I gonna build this by myself or even with the help of a friend? But surprisingly, it was super simple. Again, it uses something called Japanese joinery. So it's almost like a Lego set. So at each corner, you have the leg, you have the short side and the long side. They all come together, they click together. It's super satisfying to build. I would actually build this all over again if I had the choice, it was super fun. Then you can screw in the center leg to the center beam, put that on and with two kind of plastic screws, screw that in, no use of tools. It was really easy with Emma's help, under 10 minutes, so a very easy process. So it is as easy as they say to set up. So now let's talk about mattress support. And with the Thuma bed, you can actually buy the Thuma mattress. It's definitely a thinner all foam mattress. I wanted to test out this bed with a thicker, heavier mattress, the Avocado Green Mattress. First off, I placed it on the frame. Definitely felt supported when I lay down on the mattress on my back, side, and stomach. I could definitely feel the support of the frame underneath me. So very supportive, I think, overall. Very durable. It feels like no sagging whatsoever. So I think a supportive bed frame for any type of mattress. So now let's talk pricing. And at full price for a queen size Thuma bed, around $1,100. I think a very good deal for what you're getting. But if you want the best deal possible, we got some great coupons on mattressclarity.com and in the YouTube description below. So now the moment you've all been waiting for. Who should get the Thuma bed? First off, it's a great option, I think, if you want something more eco-friendly. This features organic materials. It also has reclaimed wood, some more eco-conscious materials in this bed frame. It's also a good option if you want something very easy to set up. You need no tools whatsoever. Throw away that Allen wrench, very easy to set up, the Thuma. And last, if you want something with a nice modern design, something low slung that doesn't take up a lot of space, the Thuma's definitely gonna work for you. So who shouldn't get the Thuma bed frame? First off, probably not the best option if you want something super, super affordable. Around $1,100, again, is good for what you're getting, but there are more affordable options out there. Also, if you want something with some more space underneath the bed, not gonna be the best option for you. Again, it's very low slung, not a lot of room for storage underneath this bed. And lastly, speaking of the look, if you don't like a lower slung bed in general, the look of that, you want something more kind of traditional and taller, I would look elsewhere. In the end, I think the Thuma bed is a great option for eco-conscious shoppers, those who want something sleek and modern, those who want something very easy to set up. But that's about it. If you want some more info on this bed, head over to mattressclarity.com for the full written review and some great money saving coupons. We'll see you next time.